Today, I have got something super helpful for all you content creators out there, especially if you are someone who likes to record professional looking videos or tutorials like I do. We're going to talk about teleprompters and I will share a complete free options that only requires two simple apps. Let's dive right in. What is teleprompter? Those who may not know, a teleprompter is a tool used to display your script in front of you while you're recording. So you can read it naturally without having to memorize every word. It helps you stay on point, improve the flow of your presentation, and keep your eyes focused on the camera. Why do content creators need one? As a content creator, we all know the struggle of forgetting what we are going to say, going off topic while we are recording. So a teleprompter is a game changer because it allows you to deliver your message smoothly, saving time on retakes and edits. It helps you sound more professional, boost your confidence on camera, and ensure that you are delivering your content in the clearest way possible. Now, I have found a free teleprompter solution that you can use easily. All you need are two apps and you're good to go. I'll be naming these two apps in just a second. But let me tell you, this setup is perfect whether you are a beginner or a seasoned creator looking to up your game without breaking the bank. This two help is background video recorder and easy scroll. Stay tuned as I walk you through how to get started with these apps. Set them up for your recording and how they can take your content creation to the next level. So let's set up the app. Once you open the app, you accept the content. Then you go to settings right here and um, you can scroll down and go to video settings so you can start with the video resolution you have different options here but just stay with 1920 by 1080p full hd that's good and then here you have different options as well but you can leave it as it is without changing anything but if you want to change anything, fine. So here, if you click on video and phone orientation, you can either choose from automatic, landscape, or portrait, whatever. So you can leave it as automatic. So next, you can go to camera. And here, there are different camera settings you can choose from. But I'm okay with this front camera aperture f2.2. Yeah, so I'm just going to leave it there so that is fine and then if the video stabilization is turned off make sure you turn it on so if it's turned off make sure you turn it on so there's nothing pretty much to do here again so you can go back if you want and the next just press the recording button Just click record so before you can start recording you need to create a folder for the app so you can just say create new folder name it whatever what you want to name it so I say teleprompter and then I say use this folder then you click allow so now you are able to record as you can see I'm recording now so this is pretty much how to set up your video uh, background video recorders so next I'll be showing you how to use the easy scroll so we are going to be dealing with the speed alone so once you click on speed set this uh, the speed to uh, one level you want so I think somewhere around 4.3 is fine and uh, you can say start and then I'll click on close after setting up the two half now let's record the first thing you have to do is to go to your phone settings and set it to auto rotate so after that you are going to look for a notepad on your phone create a new pad and then paste your script so I'm just going to use this as an example basically here yeah? So next, you're going to the video background recorder. 
start the recording. So once you start the recording, uh, you're going to minimize and then add back to your notepad. So press this button right here and then you can start reading the script. Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'll be guiding you through the process of copying Instagram profile link or URL. So let's dive right in. Step one, head over to your Instagram page and click on profile. Step two, locate the edit profile option and copy your username. So once you are done, head over to your uh, video background recorder and stop the recording. So now if you go to your gallery, the video must be synced there. So let's see the result. Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'll be guiding you through the process of copying Instagram profile link or URL. So let's dive right in. Step one. Head over to your Instagram page and click on profile. Step two, locate the edit profile option and copy your username. This is the end of this video. So if you found this video helpful, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe for more tips and tricks. Bye for now and I'll see you in my next video.